Alright guys, for Kaga Hero and welcome back to the brand new video. On today's video, finally again, One Piece Dream Pointer will be the topic. We have an update on this game and hopefully we're gonna be able to play it really, really soon. Okay, I'll explain everything on today's video. We're gonna check out also the brand new trailer for the game and the uh, official update notice they posted, okay? Leave a like, subscribe, your opinions in the comment section below and let we start. First of all, three people I will shout out on today's video. You're gonna see, first of all, Dean uh, with posting uh, this One Piece Dream Pointer new icon. I uh, absolutely love how it looks like. I'm extremely hyped for this game by the way and yeah by the way there is a big chance that this game will become global no yet confirmation like official we have just unofficial confirmation okay Uh, let me now go on Kaku's uh, Twitter post first of all and then we're gonna go on Smimisa and there we're gonna also check out the trailer so 3d uh, to blah blah alpha games um one piece dream pointer so this game is coming soon in open beta on mobile chinese version okay so open beta incoming really really soon chinese version only for now alpha games have decided to collaborate with thunder games to have a better gaming experience besides the game has been greatly improved so first of all good news guys the open beta at least for the Chinese version, is incoming really, really soon. Overall, in China, this is how it goes. They're gonna release it open beta, and soon afterwards, we're gonna have official release, or this open beta is actual release, by the way. That could be all, that's also the possibility on Chinese version. <clears throat> And yeah, the game has been greatly improved with the graphic, probably the combat system and many other things. So everything what we saw during the close beta, it's, it's now even better. Graphic wise, animation wise, strategic wise, mechanics wise, and many other things. I can guarantee you, Chinese companies don't, uh, they take this super serious, by the way. Uh, I rarely see a global company that is taking every detail in consideration and every feedback in consideration uh chinese oh yeah they're doing that bro they're doing a lot of things in consideration of course they will do as they please at the end of the day if they want to heavily monetize it they will but in most cases for the gacha game they find a really balanced way for the free to plays to be able to play this game and the pay to win players to truly enjoy it and yeah they, they always they in most cases they make a bag okay lately if if you know or you may not know chinese games tend to go global like chinese companies saw the potential of global market so they're make it happening that's why there is a big chance as well uh, plus the team of one piece dream pointer needed someone from the english side of the game let me say like that that is that unofficial confirmation. Okay, that's about that. And now we will mute this trailer. Uh, the reason for it is because of copyright. Smimisa, shout out to him as well. One Piece Dream Pointer, it has been officially announced on February 22nd that official launch will be in near future. And the specific time is to be determined. So the open beta really, really soon, the official launch really, really soon. Uh, they will determine the date, but it is happening, guys. <laughs> the game is launching pretty much. It is in a pre-launch state in a way, so I cannot wait. But like I said, first Chinese version and then global, most likely. They got a new publisher, Thunder Games, LT Games Global. LT Games Global is a game developer and publisher who strive to provide unique and unforgettable gaming experience to players around the world. So there is a chance that we get a global for this game. Okay, now let me check out this two minutes trailer. Let me see that they ch uh, change something or anything like that. This is Twitter quality, by the way. Overall, it can be better. Uh, I mean, I mean, we already know the gameplay. We're gonna check it out a little bit. 
Uh, but at the same time, I really want to see this trailer. Uh, yeah, you can fish in the game, guys. Okay, you can fish. You can move around. Go through this to this. Um, different game modes, by the way. PvP, co-op. Most likely real-time PvP as well. Bosses, story mode, beautifully done. I, I, I love the Grand Cross copy-paste here in a way. Although it's not the same. It's not the same. Have that in mind. It's not the same. Uh, it's super similar, but not the same at all. At least the concept of battles and everything else is not the same. I honestly cannot... I believe the... The ultimate card is a little bit different mechanics how you get it than in Grand Cross or something like that. I cannot now remember precisely, sorry, but I can guarantee you that um, combat mechanics are different in a way. Okay, but definitely we have a copy-paste here in a way of that turn-based card system and the style of the game, how everything is designed. Yeah, super similar, but I can guarantee you this will be a different uh, sort of game overall with some similarities. Oh, the trailer hits good. The trailer hits good. It's been already two minutes. Wow. Okay, and here, uh, shout out to Gaming Mobile here as well. Just want to show you a little bit of more gameplay and here we can end the video. To show you a little bit how it looks like. So this is the home screen. We had already like two close battles. But you can enter without your niece number. But there is ways, but complicated. Um, <clears throat> yeah, this is the menu. So you're going to be able to move around, I believe. Yes. And then here is the main quest, side quest, story. And many other menus right here. That I cannot read right now. But from, like I said, boss battle, cop, PvP. All of that is happening in this game. As far as I know. As, as I remember. And okay. So login bonuses. Missions. And now a little bit of combat for the end. Just a few minutes. And we can end it here. You already know how the gameplay looks like. I already covered it. You can check it out on my channel. You have plenty of gameplay. Plenty of gameplay. Okay. Also summoning animations. How the teams are created, uh, broken teams, broken characters. I have pretty much a lot of a lot of things. Um, Susukre gave me the opportunity to just show show his videos, so that's how I, I was able to create mo mo most of content because I, I didn't enter the close battle. Okay, now this is the gameplay. This is Ace gameplay. Absolutely love it. Have in mind it will be greatly improved. All of this, what you see, uh, really high potential. And if this game goes global, it will be a really, really big su success overall for sure. For sure. I don't see a reason why not. It's one piece. It's hype. Um, okay, some people don't like turn-based. Fine, but I believe even if you don't like it, you're going to play it because of one piece and because of animations and how cool it is and how many people will actually play it. It's crazy. And by the way, fun fact for the people who don't know, uh, this game was owned by Nuverse before. Okay, by Nuverse, which is shutting down. <laughs> by Byton, uh, which is crazy. Okay, yeah, the, the drama around Chinese companies, bro. But, yeah, they don't care. They have so much money. But, yeah, now it's a different publisher and developer. But I can tell you, they did a really good job uh, taking this game, this game and develop it properly. I like what I see overall. So soon the launch will happen, soon. <laughs> what that can mean, right? But in a couple of months, I believe for sure. And in a couple of weeks, we can get the open beta. Uh, hopefully I'll manage somehow to get in or something. Come on, Chinese developers, contact me. <laughs> just just give me you, you just give me that I play, bro. That's all what I want, okay? That's literally all, all what I want. Cool animations, as you can see. Every single character has it. This was a little bit buggy, for sure. Opponents on the other side have different uh, different amount of HP, right? Because you attack them separately. 
uh, the turn is determined based on the yeah first is our turn then his turn and so on and so on and so on so there is no speed gauge or anything like that depending on which cards you get some of them you can combine some of them not increasing the stars and buffing the cards itself and then the right combination of cards at the right time uh, it has to be used right so like that you're gonna win and this is beautiful ultimates for example i hope we're gonna have a mode where i'm gonna be play gonna, where I, I can play landscape like grand cross has it or something like that okay guys hopefully you did enjoy this video leave a like subscribe your opinions in the comment section below again good news is the game has been improved um the open beta really really soon and the official launch only chinese for now is happening really really soon like i already said because they post an official announcement on 22nd of february that's it guys love ya and bye